data science from the beginning has been core to the Stitch Fix business model. So it's to this day really at the heart of everything that we do. The entire business has some kind of algorithm behind it. You can start with merchandising, planning, and uh, buying all the clothes that we need to, to buy, forecasting for that, demand modeling, even developing new styles. We use data science for that. Of course, we have recommendation uh, engine for our styling. So the way that styling for fixes works is that we have an algorithm that will narrow down the inventory to a curated set. And then we have a human stylist at the end who always makes the final decision. And now, of course, we have data science behind lots of experimentation behind our client-facing website, which has been growing and expected to grow a lot more. Hey, everyone. Just dropping in to let you know that the annual Analytics Engineering Conference, Coalesce, is back. We had the first Coalesce last year in December, and it was fantastic. We had 3,000 registrants, tons of presentations, and this year is going to be even bigger. Register for free at coalesce.getdbt.com. What is a multi-armed bandit? Why is it useful? How do you use them at Stitch Fix? And we'll go from there. A multi-armed bandit is an algorithm to experimentally discover the highest ROI choice among a set of possible choices that all have uh, some kind of random output. The classic example and the reason it has the name multi arm Bandit that people talk about is if you had uh, a, a bunch of slot machines and you have a limited amount of money that you can put into these machines and your goal is to figure out which machine on average pays out the highest while at the same time spending as little money as possible. So the multi arm Bandit helps you trade off uh, between the uh, exploration that's needed to gather evidence about each of the options with uh, the exploit side, which is you want to maximize your winnings by picking the one that seems to be the best. Uh, yeah, I think it's maybe uh, a little more than uh, optimization problem. I would even say it's kind of the first uh, maybe introductory reinforcement learning problem where you're incorporating feedback from some system that you're interacting with in order to improve your model as you go. What does that look like in practice at Stitch Fix? Is this something that you've implemented for? Yeah, definitely. So recently we uh, started using uh, multi arm Bandit for landing page optimization. So uh, this was actually a pretty big win. We just had the results announced uh, about a week ago. Um, so the idea is when a visitor comes to stitchfix.com through some external source, say they click on an ad for Stitch Fix. The first page that we show them probably gonna have a pretty big impact on how they perceive our brand and, and how they interact with us. So we had a huge variety of options for these landing pages, lots of different creatives that we could be using. Uh, and we needed a way to figure out which one is best. Uh, because we had a big variety of options and because the traffic rate that we get is not like Google or Facebook scale we're talking about here. We have a limited amount of data to work with and a big variety of options to try out. A multi-armed bandit really became the right choice for this problem. 